Well, I'll call in Ahmed. Ahmed is not answering. Ahmed, why you are not answering, my friend? Let us see Ahmed. <clears throat> Hello? Wa alaykum salam. Uh, I know that you are speaking English. No, I speak. Uh, yeah, I'm speaking English. Good. Yeah. Okay, okay. I speak English. Huh. Uh, I if I proved one lie, if you you are a liar. Okay. Okay, no problem. This? Okay, no problem. Go ahead. You said Arabs are racist because they don't like black women, right? Uh huh. The the. The, the origin of Arabs are black. Mm -hmm. Hajar, Hajar, uh -huh. Hajar was a black Egyptian who married Abraham, who, who, who gave birth to Ismail, who was the father of the Arabs. <laughs> okay, I want to go with you. First of all, Hajar, the Coptic, are not totally black. They are darker skinned, but they aren't black. And we can show images, and people will see. They are African, yes, but they are mixed with the Roman. Because in case you do not know, that this nation is mixed with everybody, even with the Jews. Secondly, do you have any proof that Muhammad and the Arab are from Hajar? Isn't it in your book it says that Ishmael himself, he learned Arabic from the Arab at the age of 11? English, English, please, English. Ishmael is known the father of the Arab. You have to, you have to give me a proof of that. I can get you. Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. Uh, I I don't know a, a proof of hadith, but uh, but uh, another another thing that I will I will tell you that the the prophet married uh, um, a woman named Sauda, which was which was black. <laughs> Sauda doesn't mean that she is black, my friend. This is, she's an Arab. She is not a black. Sauda is a name. Listen, no. And, listen, listen. Let let us go one by one. Let's go one by one. Uh, what the age Ishmael he learned Arabic according to your religion? Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Huh? Give me a minute. I'm giving. I'll give you. A, I will give you a year. No problem. Uh, he uh, Ishmael grew up and married a Yemenian. Uh, uh, a Yemenian girl and he after that learned Arabic uh -huh. and uh, and uh, and and Abraham uh -huh. ordered him to leave the, the his wife uh -huh. okay uh, after that, okay are you done yeah well listen so you just said everybody heard you that Ishmael he learned Arabic after he married from a woman, she is from Yemen. Correct? Yeah. Okay. That means he is not the father of the Arab. That means people they speak Arabic already. So how that, so that. how he can be the father of the Arab? And if, if in this case, if I am a German and I marry a woman, she is a Chinese. According to Islam, the son will follow the father. So if the father is not an Arab, then Muhammad, if he is from Ishmael, should not be an Arab. Because Ishmael himself obviously isn't an Arab because he learned Arabic. You just say that. He himself learned Arabic from the Arab. The Arab is exist. And not only that, you're a prophet, he says that Ishmael, he learned Arabic at the age of 14. Is that correct? I don't know uh, about this and I don't memorize numbers. Well, I memorize. I, mem I memorize, my friend. I memorize. No problem. I will show you. I will give you a reference. Hold on. Give me a second. Uh, it says in the Hadith, uh, that the first time, the first one who learned from, like, supposedly between you, is Ismail, and he was 14 years old. Do you agree with that or no? Well, again, because I was opening the YouTube. Huh? What? Can you can you repeat it? Because I opened the YouTube. I was opening the YouTube. Okay. 
According to your prophet, he was the first of the tribes to speak Arabic, you know, from his tribe, not from the Arab. And when Allah taught him Arabic, he forgot the language of his father. Is that correct? He forgot the language of his father. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What, what is his father's uh, nationality? Uh, Aramaic. No, oh, it is not Aramaic. He, 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 so, he was, so what? He, what? He was, what was the language? I, of, I, what was I the Iran. language of? What was the language of Abraham? He was born in Iraq. Okay, but the people in Iraq at that time they are the Aramaic. They okay. speak. They speak Aramaic. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, so now Bro, Ishmael, Ishmael, listen, Ishmael. I'm going to show you a bunch of uh, reference, all right? And you can you can read yourself, and this is from your books. You will see that your prophet, and you are the one who agree, that your prophet, he made it clear that Ishmael never spoke Arabic. And then, according to the, the uh, your books, Ishmael, he married from uh, the tribe of Jerham. But Jerham are the enemy of the tribe of Quraysh. In fact, Quraysh kicked Jerham from Mecca. So how he is from, he is married to Jerham, and Muhammad is not from the tribe of Jerham, and then Muhammad is from Jerham. No, 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 Muhammad isn't, Muhammad is from Quraysh. Muhammad is from Quraysh, no problem. I'm saying, Ishmael, according to your books, he married from Jerham. No, no where it says that he's, he was married, he married Jerham. Let us show you. Here we go. I will show you some reference. Here we go. And you speak Arabic, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. This is your this is your book. It says here, we will show in Arabic and then we will translate the website to English. It says here, قال رسول الله أول من فتق رسانه بالعربية المبينة إسماعيل وهو ابن أربعة عشر سنة the first one who spoke the language, it was Ishmael, and he was 14 years old. Correct? This is the book of Kanzul Ummal, 11490. And Majma'u Tabrasi, Ismail, and he repeating the same hadith. Do you see it? Now, yeah. he married from the tribe of Jerham. Here we go. What we know, Hajar alayhi salam, and the Amr al ilahi atta bi tarkiha, in the ma yu'araf liyum. Etc. It says here, Do you see it? Because it so he introduced to Jerham, which is an Arabian tribe. But this is the enemy tribe of Quraysh. And Jerham used to be in charge of Mecca. And then Quraysh where, kicked. Where is this is the enemy? Where is this the enemy? Where is this, yeah, this is from your history books. We can show you tons of reference, my friend. Well, you see, this is recorded because uh, you know if we say something, uh, you know people will laugh at us, right? If we say something not true, people will laugh at you and at me, right? People are watching, but this is your. So how how Ishmael he is the father of the Arab, but he is learning Arabic from the Arab. That means Arabic has exist and the Arab exists before Ishmael. If I marry a Chinese woman, if I marry a Chinese woman, is the Chinese my kids? It's a Chinese, your kids? Yes, if I marry, if I go to China now and I marry a Chinese woman, can you say that the Chinese are the children of a Christian prince and he is an Arab? So they are Arab? No. Okay, but this is what happened. According to you, Ishmael, according to your books, not our books, according to your books, Ishmael, he married from Arabian women from the tribe of Jerham, not from the tribe of Quraysh. And those a tribe, he, they are the one who taught him uh, Arabic. And as you see here says, and this is your book, and you are the one who asked me how you can prove that they speak Aramaic. Do you see what it says? وَأَوَّلِ لِسَانَ الْعَرَبِي فَصِيَحْ مُتَكَلِّمْ بِلِسَانْ هُوَ إِسْمَائِلْ عَلَيْهِ السَّلَامِ Nabi. Listen, okay, no, listen, listen. Yeah, but he, he learned Arabic from, you are the one who said to me, learn Arabic from, you know, and here it says that too. They are saying he is the first one who speak a perfect Arabic because Allah taught him. But the Arab are speaking Arabic already. And here they say 
that Ibrahim, uh, 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 the, the children of Ibrahim and Ibrahim and Ishaq, his brother, they used to speak Syriac language. Do you see it? As Syriania. Not Aramaic. Syriania is Aramaic, my friend. Syriac is Aramaic. Yeah. So as you see, all this drama, it doesn't make sense. Secondly, you are the whole point supposedly to prove to me about the black and white. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Did your Quran say that Allah will make all non-Muslims, those who don't believe in Allah, black? No, no. He, he from, from the heat of Jahannam, uh -huh. uh, their, their face will be black. <laughs> okay. So... Are you saying to me that a person is color black because he is from the people of Jahannam? No, uh, no, no, it's not like this. Not like so this. what is this? What it is? Because the Quran says Allah will make all those who don't believe black and all those who believe white. And this is a chapter 3 verse 106. Exactly. Yeah. It means like it, it was white and then it went black. Okay, but okay, okay. So they were white. Allah will make them as a penalty black, correct? So being a black in Islam is a penalty, it's not a reward. The Muslims, all of them, Allah will make them white. Is that correct? He will make them very white. Allah will make the Muslims very white, not only white. And he will make those who they are not Muslims very black. Is that correct? It, it is related to the, the the feelings. Imagine yourself, you will be judged by God and you know you sinned all your life. How, how will be your face? So my face will be black because I sinned all my life? Uh, it is like of the sins. Oh, so you are saying that I sin. If I sin, Allah will make, uh, I will be black. So sin make people black. That's what you are saying. No, the sins is like marks. And it would make it okay so so people. sin sin make you black uh, exactly this is what we are saying Bro, Islam teach that you when you sin Allah will make you black bro, bro you, you put you put Jesus in your churches don't you a white man don't change no 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 first first of all all of those you go you go to Africa Jesus is a black you go to Asia Jesus is a Filipino he is a Korean you go to a white society that's normal but this is all not not from the Bible People they make those are not even accepted from the Bible. The Bible says, "Make no images for what up in heaven or down on earth." This is the Bible. People they do sin. People they do wrong. I'm asking you now, why you? This is your God, not people doing that. Your God saying, He will make all those who believe in Him white, and you just said, Allah will make you black because you commit sin. See on the day when some faces will be lit up with like the light. No, you will make it white. Don't, there's no light. There's no light. Don't don't add word. You speak Arabic. I speak Arabic. It says No, no. Not light up. The translation. You are not a translator. A perfect translator. This is a false translation. That's why they put it between two brackets. This is why between two brackets. It's it's false. And you speak Arabic. So it will be white between two bracket. It's false. It's not there. We go by what's there and then he says here again but those who their faces will be white they will be uh, with Allah mercy there's no light of the word of Allah see they are adding if you if you change the translator this is Yusuf Ali if you change the translator you will see the translation totally change because Muslim they corrupt their Quran they are they don't have an honest translation never I, I saw a Muslim have an honest translation look where is where is the, the they will be light no light it's white Bro, I, I ask you something. Hmm. If you like a forger and you forge and your hand went black, will you go to clean it, right? So you are saying to me, if you if you are committing sin a forgery, your hand will be black. Don't play with don't play with with words. I say if you cleaned your hand from black substance or black. Forgery, yeah, but you see, racist, if I am no, you say racist. No. Hold on, so. Allah now he is rewarding the ones who they are believers by being white and he is punishing he's not making why he is why even who care for the color why he care for the color why what a big deal why Allah don't take them 
Uh, the black, the white, the, the Indian, everybody, no problem. He's a Muslim taken to heaven. Why he will make all Muslim white and all non-Muslim black? Like, uh, uh, the, it is it is in the afterlife. The afterlife has... No, no, uh, no, uh, no, no. Oh, okay, hold on. Let us say I will go with you. After light, before light, who okay, cares? Like, it doesn't matter. Still, Allah will make the believers white and non-believers black. Life now, okay. life after. No. And not only that, isn't it your prophet? He said that when Allah created Adam, he created the the, the white uh, 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 the white people from the right shoulder of Adam. And he created the black people from the left shoulder of uh, uh, Adam. And then he said to the one created from the, white, uh, from the light, uh, right shoulder, you go to heaven, which means the white. And he said to those who they are created from the left shoulder, which means the black, you go to hell and I don't care. This is not right. What if I show you the hadith? What if I show you the hadith? The hadith I know is there is no difference between a black and white except for that is a that is a fake hadith. Thing. That is a fake hadith. No, no, no. I it's athene, athene, uh, it's sahih. Okay, which book? Which book? This book we can find it. I will get it for you. Hmm. I'm waiting for you. Downloading. Hmm? The entrance is uh, there is no superiority for an Arab over an Arab. No yeah, we we, Arab we heard this before. Arab. We heard before. Yeah, but this is fabrication. Yeah, fabrication. No, I can't. Okay, you see, oh, hold on, hold on. It is, is, you are the one who said to me when you call me, you said to me, Muhammad is from Ishmael. Is. is that because you believe that there is people who they are superior to people or you because it doesn't matter no like i i don't get you sorry okay when you muslims you mentioned that muhammad is from ishmael is that because ishmael family are superior above mankind or be or because they are equal to all mankind and doesn't matter no the the they 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 are equal but they, they are higher from each other by good deeds and a sinful man is not like a good man uh, this is not the, what i'm asking because a sinful man not equal to etc but that will be uh, like in the day of judgment we are talking about when you are created according to islam if there is people allah he wanted them favor them upon all mankind he decided even before he made them that they are favored upon all mankind. Yes or no? Uh, do you mean the ch children of Israel? Doesn't matter. I'm asking you why you are afraid to answer. Either you say to me, yes, there is people that uh, 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 Allah consider them superior, or you say there is all people are equal. It is the same in the Bible, the kingdom of God. Okay, no problem. I'm asking you about you. I will, I will answer about my Bible yeah. now. I will answer yeah, about the my Bible. Children of Israel was the, the God made them. Oh, okay, no. Uh, first of all, no, than, no, 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 no. In the Bible, God did not make them higher. In the Bible, is those who chosen God, God with them. You will see that God of the Bible, He punished them when they are not with Him. When they are following idols worshiping, God Himself, He punished them. So God did not favor them. Now listen. When you favor God, God favor you. But in Islam, no. In Islam, you believe in destiny. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. So when Allah created Adam and he created his children, did he make a destiny that the black ones will go to hell and the white ones will go to heaven? Huh? The, the, no, the companion of the Prophet Oh. Uh, he was from the person uh, to, from the people that the prophet said to him, uh, to him that he will enter Jannah. 
he will enter Jannah. He is fooling him. Isn't it your prophet? He made fun of the look of Bilal. He says, Rasahu Rasu Zabiba. He have he said he said you obey your master, your chief. He hired him to be a chief because he's a strong black man. And then he made fun of his look, he says, his head is a raising head. Is that true? No. Okay. No, no, no. Get, get me get me your hadith. All right, here we go. Okay, no, no problem. Here we go. We will go to the hadith. You can see my screen? Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Let us see the hadith about Bilal. Here we go. Do you see it? Yeah. He, yeah. he, he made fun of your of the Ethiopian and he said, uh, <clears throat> the, you know, he hired him, but he never freed him. Still, he's asleep. This is number one. Muhammad, he owned Bilal. Abu Bakr bought Bilal. And Muhammad never released him. This is why after he died, Bilal was crying, you know, he said to Abu Bakr, if you bought me for the sake of Allah, if uh, you know, then release me for the sake of Allah. If you bought me for yourself, keep me for yourself. And we can show you the hadith. The Prophet said, listen and obey. Your chief is not a free man, but he made him a chief because he is good in war. He gave him a group of our, 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 our Muslims. You are in charge of them. Those Arab, they say, we will not let a black man to lead us. Muhammad, instead of saying, so what if he's a black man? He's making fun of his look, he says. Obey him even if he is an Ethiopian who is head is like a raisin where made your chief. Do you see it? It was not to Bilal. It was not to Bilal. It was not? It was not to Bilal. Where is it to Bilal? Uh, it's about Bilal. It's about Bilal. You, and and, and, and doesn't, it doesn't matter really if it's Bilal or not. You know, it doesn't matter. So are you saying to me that your prophet will say that about different slave, but he will not say that about uh, uh, Bilal? He said, listen and obey your chief, even if an Ethiopian whose head is like a raisin or me. Yeah, so how your prophet see the black? Chief. Yeah, obey him. He made him a chief because now he is needing him for war. He is a slave himself. He is not a chief, really. This is why those Arab, they said, we will not allow a black slave to control us. Muhammad, he said, listen, even if he is a raisin head and he is an Ethiopian, obey him for now. Right? And why he's making fun of his face? Why he's making fun of his look? He can say, obey your chief, even if he is a Ethiopian, and that's it. Why he is mentioning that the look of his head? Why he's making fun of his head? Bro, bro uh, where, where the intention of fun? I don't get it. The intention is very clear. You, you're a prophet Thank making fun. Okay, is, a, is shaitan, is shaitan in Islam, is an Ethiopian, and he is a black man? Shaitan black? Yeah. No. The the uh, the jinn was made of smokeless fire. There's nothing about the 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 characteristic of the shaitan. So I'm asking a very specific question. Is the one who will destroy the Kaaba is Ethiopian and he is a black? No, no, no. This is Ibrahim al Habashi and he tried to destroy the the Kaaba. God made him feel. It is Ibrahim al Habashi. No, no. no. This, is a, this is a fiction story. I'm talking about something else. A person. It's not fiction. My friend. It, 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 it was. We can go there later. Simple. We can go there. But I'm asking you a different story. Different story. Is it true that your prophet, he said, that a person who have funny legs because he's a black, he is the one who will do destroy the Kaaba? No. Shall we show the hadith? Yeah. All right. Okay. Here we go. We go in the hadith. Read it for me. You said to me, no, remember? Yeah. Okay. Do you see it? It is not loaded yet. Yeah, it got the the messenger. Allah peace be upon him. Hear and obey, even if and no, no, different one. This is a different one. I'll show you a different one. Yeah, 
Listen and obey even no. My friend, this is a different one. It says in Arabic, "You carry the Kaaba." The so we, so, yeah, go ahead. Uh -huh. By Absinian, Absinian man having too small shank. Yeah. So he's what? He's making fun of his legs. He is Absinian. He is an Ethiopian. Uh, bro, uh, he, he is an enemy. I don't know. It is Doesn't matter. He is a black man. He is a black man. Okay. Who is the uh, uh, who is the one uh, Allah hate most? Who is the one Allah hate most? Yeah. Uh, is it yeah. a black man? Uh, the David. Is it a black man? I really no, he didn't sit the black man. Didn't sit the black man. All right. So let us see. If this is true or not. You know, you notice everything you say to me, I show you the hadith. And then, you you know, like it turned to be that I'm right and you are wrong. Right? Each time you say something what? to me, each time you say, I, each time I say to you something, you say no, and it turned to be true. Why no, is that? It is, I, 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 I am. I don't memorize the hadith. I memorize the Quran. Okay, but you are the Muslim who called me to prove me uh, as a liar. Okay, okay, I, I, I can prove you in something. I, I surely know that. Let us, that, uh, let us finish. No let us, let us finish. Uh, let us finish, uh, one by one. Uh, let us see here. Like here, as you see, even your prophet, even he discriminated animals just because of their black. Like a black dog is the devil. Is that correct? Uh, uh, it is the hadith that says the prayer is served by a woman. Yeah, it says, uh, they ask him, why the black dog? What's specific about the black dog? He says the black dog is the devil. Is that correct? The prayer is served by a woman, a donkey, and the black dog. If there is not something like the handle of saddle. Can you get the Arabic one? The Arabic, it says here. Uh, Can you get the Arabic one? Hold on, give me a second. Ah, this one here. It says here, you can read in Arabic, no problem. Hmm. What is the it is Daif. Daif, yeah. Yeah, so? Not a synetic. Huh? It is not a synetic. So, so, so are you saying to me, you Muslims, you lie about what your prophet say? No, 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 no. Uh, so what, the, what do you mean? The, 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 there was like, we have so, sources that you don't have. We say, I can say five persons to the Hadith. The, to the one who narrated the hadith, um, the one like that the, the, they were like many people who purified it. Like, if um, you, for example, for example, uh -huh. you narrated a hadith about the prophet, okay, and I asked the person who hear, heard it, hmm. uh, did you listen to, um, uh, for example, Christian Prince? Hmm. This is the hadith, hmm. he says, Yes, I, I go to Christian Prince, he is dead. How do you how do you uh, how do you say the hadith when it uh, when he is dead? Hmm. But so, isn't it all the hadith you collect them more than two hundred no, years no, after Muhammad? Daif. No, first daif. of all, first of all, first of all, this is not daif. This is sahih. But I wanted to show people how Muslims they try to find a solution to run away. 
they change their answer depend in what proof we give, not their, their faith and what they believe, no. Uh, they find an excuse to escape. Suddenly, you just start giving me a story about what is da'if and what's sahih, but shouldn't all the Muslim books be having only true stories about their prophet? Why Muslim will lie about their prophet? Why Muslim they say to us that we are Muslims who lie about what Muhammad did and what Muhammad said, and now we, we print it in a book, we translate it, we publish it. The second you show it to me, I say to you, I don't accept it. So why is this a drama? That means Muslims' sources cannot be trustworthy, number one. Number two, when a Muslim, he say this is Sahih, it's just a fabrication too. Why? Because you said to me, somebody is dead. How we can be find out? Well, those hadith are collected by people who exist hundreds of years after Muhammad. They never saw Muhammad. They never met Muhammad. They never saw the companion of Muhammad. So how we can be sure that what it said been said? All is this is a fabrication, the same as the Quran. If I ask you, if, if I, listen, listen. Let us let us make it simple. Let us go back to the Quran. That will be better. Uh, I I want to argue with in the day in the day of, in the day of judgment in the day of judgment. How people will become white and black? Is that like Allah will command? the bad one to become black and the good one to be white or he will use somebody no it is not mentioned he, he, he bro if he, if you are sad or like shocked of something your face we say your face turns dull then black because you are depressed is this racist no it's not racist it's the the the, the human uh, uh, nature Mm. It, it, if you if you are depressed or something, your uh, your face turns black. But imagine of you, the end of your life will be a tell. Okay, but this is not an answer. I'm asking you. And yeah. when Allah, He will make people black and white in the day of judgment. The bad ones, He will make them black. The good ones, Allah will make them white. Is that by Allah saying you be black and you be white, or Allah will send somebody? No, it is their nature. Oh. What do you mean? Like the, the 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 people who sin know they sin, so they they will be very scared and and sad that their face will turn the dull or like. So you are saying so you are saying this will happen automatically. Yeah. Okay, uh, we will go to that when Allah created them in the beginning, black and white. How Allah created somebody black and how He created him white. And then we will go back to heaven to understand. I don't know, honestly. Okay. So what do you know? Uh, I, I I know uh, uh, the, the hadith that I told you, uh, there is no difference. Well, we are reading Quran now, and we, are in, we, we will read Sahih hadith too. As an example here, this is your prophet hadith, it says. You can see it with me in the screen. And this is a very authentic hadith. It says, When Allah created Adam, when he created him, he struck his right shoulder and he brought forth his offspring white like small ants. And then he struck his left shoulder and he brought forth offspring uh, 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 black like shirkur. Then he said to the party from his right side, which means the white ones, you go to paradise and I don't care. And he said to the one who they are brought from the left shoulder, you go to hell and I don't care, which means the black. This is your prophet statement. Wait, wait a minute, I check it. I check it here. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. he, he, he produced uh, the, uh, the, the black people yeah. like they would uh, uh, mag. Yeah. Uh, is this is this hadith meant to to the the black skin? Mm -hmm. It says, yeah, it no. says he made them black, like a black circle. He made white, he made it black. Those are human, those are not uh, chicken. Those are human, those are children of Adam. So, 
from the right shoulder, right in Islam, the right hand of Islam, it means the good hand. Left hand in Islam, it means the bad hand. So according to your religion, according to your religion, black people are created from the bad shoulder, white people created from the good shoulder. See the 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 characteristic uh, characteristic of blackness for this uh, for this like mm -hmm. they it doesn't mean their skin color. My friend, it says it clearly. They are black and they are white, and you are saying to me, so okay, what is black about them? Why it's mentioned that the Riyatan Baida of spring. Uh, he hang up. Mr. Ahmad, he hang up. Let's call him again. I think he decided to flee. Do you think he will answer? Let us mute the speaker until he answer. I don't think he will answer. Yeah, it's time to fly. He's not answering. All right, no problem. What we can do. So as you see, this is what Islam is about. Racism, hatred, and discrimination. Why does God wanna make such a statement? He created the black from the left shoulder and the white from the right shoulder. And those are their books. And those are authentic hadith. All of this, what we see here, is authentic hadith. Those are the reference. Can the Muslim deny? This is the book of Musnad al-Imam Ahmad. We can find the same from At-Turmudi, etc. Then it says, very number six, page number 441. Allah created the black from the left shoulder. And he created, you know, uh, uh, actually this one is different hadith, let me see. But, and you know, anyway, like he created the black from the left shoulder. This Maybe you need to scroll down to see the other one. Where is the other one? Yeah, anyway, that one we showed him is enough. But as you see, this is cannot be, you know, the Muslim, they try to fool black people. They say to them, Islam for everybody. In, in fact, Islam is an extremely racist cult made for the Arab, the white Arab only. What the heck is that? <laughs> Ha 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 ha!